We've got a way for you to support our returning troops just by buying some really cool combat boots online through bootcampaign.com. And the call is going out to our local first responders to help out as well. Yeah, we got Rich Withy here from uh, Stat Medivac. And you're asking what? Uh, nurses, doctors, police, fire to buy these boots and come out and take a picture. Anybody in public safety, ER techs, doctors, fire, police. EMS, anybody, go to www.bootcampaign.com, get your boots on, and join us. Now, these are combat-style boots. Absolutely. These are uh, what the GIs are getting issued over in Afghanistan and Iraq right now. Now, you asked us to buy these boots. This must benefit something or some organization. Absolutely. It benefits multiple uh, wounded veteran-type uh, charities, but namely, it, it's the Lone Survivor Foundation started by uh, Navy SEAL Marcus Luttrell. And that's the one that our own Joe Nichols is representing yeah, with the yeah, shape I'm in. Absolutely. And these are men and women returning, injured, maybe post-traumatic stress disorder, yep. and the Lone Survivor Foundation helps them. So, the way to show solidarity with our troops overseas is if you need a cool pair of boots, work boots, heavy-duty boots. Absolutely. You can go to bootcampaign.com. How much of the funds go to the military charities? Anywhere from 25 to $45, depending on what style of boots you get, goes directly to the troops. Now, what about if, like, let's say we're not in public safety, I'm a construction worker, I want to help out, do get I have access on. to these boots? Absolutely. Get your boots on. They have about nine nine different pairs of boots on the website now, and uh, they have a boot to fit just about anybody. Rich Withy's with us uh, from Stat Medivac. You're putting out the call to show support to our troops for all the first responders, uh, police, medics in the area. The employees of Stat Medivac and myself, uh, thanks to the Center for Emergency Medicine and the uh, Stat Medivac uh, administration, they're helping us out, and we're going to try and do a big event out at our headquarters at Allegheny County Airport in West Mifflin, April 16th at uh, 10 o'clock in the morning. We're uh, talking to local and national uh, media and uh, they're going to hopefully do a big story on the patriotism of public safety in southwestern Pennsylvania. What is the event going to consist of? People in their everyday work uniform, uh, police, fire, and EMS like we talked about with these boots. Uh, I'd love for you guys to come out, bring a piece of apparatus, be it your favorite police car, fire truck, ambulance. Come on out, have it in the picture. It's going to be posted on bootcampaign.com. It's going to bring a lot of attention to our wounded vets. And it's also a way for Pittsburgh to kind of be represented in this national mm, yes, campaign to yes. help these of yes. men and women out. It's www.bootcampaign.com. Nice idea. All right, there's the call going out. Uh, where can you find out more, Rich? You can uh, look us up on Facebook at the Employees and Friends of Stat Medivac Pay It Forward. Uh, you can give me a call, 412-260-3574. If you can, pick up your boots by April 5th. Yep, and you'll get them in the mail probably three to five business days. Again, the site for everybody, whether you're a first responder or not, www.bootcampaign.com. Dot com. Go shopping for a cool pair of boots. Rich Withy from Stat Medivac with us, helping us to remember to support our men and women who were returning from overseas. Thank you very much, Rich. Hey, thanks for having me in, guys. Thanks.